presidents in the past that have said, oh, the only thing we had to fear is fear itself, encouragement. And now we have presidents that say, don't let a good crisis go to waste. And if we don't do what I say to do, we're going to head into a depression that is unlike anything we've ever seen. And you can kiss your lifestyle goodbye. Basically, rulers appeal to their subjects' fears and uh, insecurities and deep nationalistic patriotism when it serves their purpose. We're a Christian nation when it serves their purpose. But when we're told in another country by our president, we are not a Christian nation, that person is not in touch. It's not that they've lost touch with us. They never had it. They've never been in touch with you and me and what we believe. If rebellious anti-tax voices like ours today were to gain influence, the rulers would be worse off and forced to carry out the people's wishes. You know, we say the government works for us. I have employees. If an employee came to me and said, here's what you're going to pay me, and here's what you're going to give me a raise every year, and here's money you're going to use to spend on projects I want, that employee would be fired. Why are we not firing these people? If they truly work for us, if we are the boss, let's fire these people. You see, free speech, free speech and the power to tax are incompatible. Free speech and the power to tax are incompatible. What you're doing today and what I'm doing today does not fit the agenda of the very people we voted into office. And the corruption there is so intense it takes a man or a woman of stature that is rare in our country, but they're out there. They can stand firm and say, I will not sell my soul for the almighty dollar. I will do what I was voted my constituents into this office to do. And let me close with this. Purposeful choice in the realm of voluntary behavior among ordinary people tends to improve life. Let me say that again. Purposeful choice in the realm of voluntary behavior among ordinary people tends to improve life. Purposeful choice among rulers tends to destroy life because rulers act on their wants not those of their taxpayers. I hope this meeting is only the beginning of a nationwide movement that takes away the unintended power of our state and federal governments to tax us into oblivion. We will not go quietly into the night. Thank you. Thank you. How about that? I love Steve Keeper. He's incredible. Thank you.